This is Florida Gulf Coast University. project exhibition is called Foundation First. I worked with two classes of fourth graders who worked together to develop a story called Ocean of Dreams. It deals with the, the waste that you know ultimately goes into our oceans. I'm Nick Jerzeski and I'm a graphic designer. The title of my project is Perpetual Metamorphosis. I believe that the aesthetics and graphic design are always changing like every single year. Hello, I'm Joseph. Uh, my project was the trophy room. I've always kept animals very close to me. I tried to kind of wrap memories and nostalgia and, and loss and, and honor and dignity you know, all together. Hi hey everyone, I'm Lauren and the title of my presentation is Thrive. And I wanted to make kind of a formula along with how we can thrive in our environment, which is to use our knowledge and our action to grow and to thrive. My name is Meg Schaaf and my project was Las Meninas Metamorphosing. This painting is from Velasquez, a Spanish painter, and I wanted to set the whole painting into a three-dimensional setting and set the girl free. interpretation of the decline of the mind and memories as a person descends into Alzheimer's disease. So as you walk through, you're kind of put into this mindset of the memories are now disappearing. Maybe you will talk about it more. Maybe people will start thinking about the future instead of letting it go unspoken. I'm Megan Dennison. Um, my piece is Rehabitat Elation. The idea for my piece came from the fact that we have corrupted nature so much that they've had to adapt to our way of living. My name is Angela Hicks and the title of my piece is called Thread the Wind Dancer. Um, it is both performance and sculpture. I have studied the aspects of fashion throughout history especially during the early 20th century, the dance, or two dances, the sword balancing dance and the wing dance. They symbolize overcoming fear, uh, the strength of an inner woman and body and mind balance and soul. 